Hey everybody, Straight On Billy here doing song number 568 in 568 days in a row. We started doing one song every day, posting it on my Straight On Billy YouTube channel uh, back on August 7th of 2020, 568 days ago. And we're going to keep on doing one song a day until this COVID-19 pandemic is brought under control. And we can go out and play some regular gigs again with the whole band, including guitars, drums, more keyboards. Please check out the website, straydog.org. That's where I got my nickname, Stray Dog Billy, short for Stray Dog Bill Arnold. Today, yeah, we're going to keep on doing my originals for a while. And uh, this, is, uh, this one's called Yo Sé Que Me Quieres. I know that you love me. And here we go. Estoy seguro que sí. Yo sé que me ama. Estoy seguro que sí. Tú sabes que a ti te quiero Estoy seguro que sí Que me quieres Estoy seguro Que sí Yeah, short version Yes Stray dog, no kill, dog shelter My first wife, the late Pat Arnold Who passed on in 03, tragically very sadly, unexpectedly, of a brain aneurysm. She and I started that shelter, Stray Dog, back in 1994. And we became a Texas nonprofit corporation in 97. With the official name, Stray Dog Incorporated. So that's really the official start, 1997. Then in 1998, we uh, applied for, received from the IRS. 501c3 tax exempt status, making all donations and contributions to the shelter tax deductible. We are still going strong today, still rescuing, rehabilitating, and adopting out formerly stray and other formerly homeless dogs and once in a while cats to good homes. We're going to keep on doing this until the overpopulation problem in the dog and cat world across the United States of America is brought under control and we no longer have to keep on rescuing, rescuing, rescuing homeless animals. Now, we are across this nation, all 3,500 animal shelters are adopting out lots and lots 
of dogs and cats. This is a great thing. In, in the year 2019, we have full figures. 3.2 million dogs and cats were adopted out from all 3,500 shelters across the country in 2019. 1.6 million dogs, 1.6 million cats, just happened to be about an equal number. That's an average of 4,400 dogs adopted out every single day of the year 2019. 4,400 per day adopted out to good homes. 4,400 cats adopted out every day of the year 2019. Tremendous accomplishment. All shelters and pounds deserve our financial support to help them continue to rescue these precious animals. Now there's a very dark side to this overpopulation problem. Checking to see where Chuck B. Toe is. No, he doesn't have to go out. Anyway, there's a very dark side, very tragic side to the overpopulation problem in the dog and cat world. And that is that we are still as a society across this nation using euthanasia to get rid of the extras. Euthanasia is meant for terminally ill dogs and cats so they, so they don't have to suffer. For fatally injured dogs and cats and other animals so they don't have to suffer. That's what euthanasia is meant to be used for. But we as a society have been using it for decades and decades and decades and decades to get rid of our surplus, the ones that we allow to be born But we can't find them all homes. Now we're doing a lot better than we used to, as we pointed out in 2019. That was a that was a, 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 a great accomplishment. We are still, though, however, euthanizing 1,700 approximately, an average of 1,700 dogs and cats every single day of the year. Right now, today, tomorrow, the next, yesterday. This is a terrible, terrible tragedy. Now, 10 years ago, or 11 years ago in 2011, it was even worse. It was 7,000 per day instead of 1,700. And 52 years ago in 1970, we were euthanizing across this country to get rid of surplus dogs and cats, 41,000 dogs and cats every single day of the year. 1970. It was worse before that. It's gotten a little bit better ever since. We're down to 1700 now. What do we have to do to stop this? In addition to more and more ad uh, adoptions, because we're all trying to do that, what are we going to do to stop it? Knowing that mama dogs and mama cats, with the help of papa dogs and papa cats, are going to keep on delivering to us to take care for them, which we gladly do because that's our purpose. Litter after litter after litter after litter of puppies and kittens and puppies and kittens and puppies and kittens. We know this is what's going on. This is what's been going on. It's going to continue to go on until what? Until we get control of conception and stop conception. How do you do that? In the dog and cat world, We've already known about this for decades and decades and decades. It's called spay and neuter. If we will all spay and neuter our pets, the overpopulation problem in the dog and cat world will come to an end. And that'll be it. We'll be back again tomorrow with another song from the Stray Dog Billy One Man Band.